one thing's for certain, the UK is not a fan of data localization. That's not something you're going to see across the board in uh, the UK. In terms of priority for adequacy, you know, they've indicated US, Australia, uh, Colombia, Dubai, South Korea, Singapore, Brazil, Indonesia, Kenya, you know, so it's an interesting mixed bag. You know, we've got countries with long-standing ties to Britain and the Commonwealth. We've got countries that are very big business hubs. Uh, most of these aren't recognized as adequate by the European Union. So it'll be a question of how are they going to accomplish adequacy in some of these. So for instance, you know, India yeah, doesn't have a data protection regime. It's got kind of some IT security rules that touch on sensitive and personal data, but they don't provide comprehensive privacy rights. I think South Korea's low hanging fruit, I think. Uh, well, the, the EU has already recognized them as adequate since we've left, so yeah. Exactly. <laughs> They're going to piggyback on what the European Commission's done there. Um, so I think South Korea will probably be one of the first adequacy decisions we see. I know they're in talks with the US. They expect whatever comes out of the discussions with the European Commission on Privacy Shield 2.0 is going to be available for the UK as well. So I expect that by the end of the year. 